Hey, thanks. Pixar Animation's Inside Out 2 is new in theaters. It's been nine years since the first one, if you can believe that. I'm anxiety. Where can I put my stuff? A new emotion. Oh, Last time we went inside little girl Riley's mind and met her emotions personified like joy and sadness and anger. Well, now Riley's a teenager hitting puberty, so in comes new emotions like anxiety and embarrassment to take over the place. Maya Hawk and Iowa Debris join voice cast returnees like Amy Poehler and Louis Black. And though it's maybe not quite as fresh a story as the first movie, it is not surprisingly very clever and smart and thoughtful and funny and sweet. I really liked it. We trusted you, Catherine, when you're flirting with the radicals. All right, then also new in select area theaters, Firebrand, a new historical drama with Alicia Vikander as the sixth and final wife to King Henry VIII, played by Jude Law. You have none of the common sense. Also, the comedy Treasure, which sends Lena Dunham of Girls on a trip to Poland with Stephen Fry, her Holocaust survivor father. And from India, Chandu Champion, the true story of India's first Olympic gold medalist. And classics, you of course got the Lord of the Rings trilogy back this weekend. And in a few theaters on Father's Day, Field of Dreams. Sometimes the pink opaque feels more real than real life. Or now we go home, where an acclaimed movie that never played in our area comes to premium VOD, I Saw the TV Glow. Starring Justice Smith, it's a surreal trans allegory about two outcast teens in the 90s who bond over a supernatural young adult TV show and then question their identities. What's stopping you from being enlightened? Are you enlightened right now? And then new on demand, you got Bad Behavior with Jennifer Connelly as a troubled former child actress at a spiritual retreat. Also Reverse the Curse, directed by and starring David Duchovny as a dying Boston Red Sox fan. His son, Logan Marshall Green of Upgrade, fakes a winning streak, so he can cheer dad up. And set in Stephenville, Texas, Ride, about a family of bull riders. That stars C. Thomas Howell, Jake Allen, and Yellowstone's Forey J. Smith. Colin cannot discover my secret. Whistledown is power. And on to streaming we go, where more new episodes of Bridgerton just hit Netflix. Come to daddy. Along with Ultraman Rising, a new animated movie starring that long-running Japanese superhero. And Remembering Gene Wilder, the documentary about that late great actor. The next The Dark Superhero Hit the Boys is back for a new season on Amazon Prime. Peacock adds Monkey Man, Dev Patel's action revenge movie set in India. I really like that. And Paramount Plus has How Music Got Free, a docuseries about music piracy. Then we go to Hulu, who have Bratz, a new documentary about the Brat Pack actors from the 80s, directed by one of them, Andrew McCarthy. My suspect, because I did not kill her. The new on Apple TV Plus is Presumed Innocent. Yeah, new miniseries based on the same novel as that Harrison Ford movie. Now it's Jake Gyllenhaal, starring as a lawyer accused of murdering his mistress.